So welcome everybody. This is the Leadership Forum 2023 edition and Katy O'Dowd is joining us. Good morning and thank you so much for being with us. My pleasure. So let me just give you a bit of context. Um, she is, of course, a professional mountaineer and climber mm -hmm. and you conquered the Everest twice. So what's mm -hmm. behind this success? Obviously, you have to have a great physical education. Um, and on the other side, I guess, um, great mentality and a huge spirit. So can you talk to us, what, it, what did it cost you? It's a great question because people jump straight to physical fitness, which is obvious, but it's really only entry level. Clearly you have to be fit enough and strong enough uh, to do this, but there's so much more to it. The next thing you need is a level of meticulous planning I mean, no amount of fitness gets you past not having enough food to finish the climb. There are all sorts of things that you have to be planned well in advance because they can't be resupplied once you're out there. But even that doesn't get you past the next block, which is essentially mental and emotional. When people get up there and realize that they like the idea of the goal, but they haven't thought about what they're going to have to invest in the journey, in the process. How much time is spent going backwards to get more equipment or to acclimatize or stuck in a tent in a snowstorm? How much of it is profoundly uncertain, uncomfortable? And people crumble in the face of the uncertainty and the discomfort. So a lot of that can be um, avoided by coming to the project, not just with fitness and planning, but with kind of extensive training, mental preparation, working on your skill set, working on your ability to be creative in difficult circumstances. Sometimes there's no shortcut for just having built experience over time to allow you to then step up to the very big project. So um, did you try to explain this on the stage of the Leadership Forum 2023 to the, to the huge crowd of managers that I mean, success is, how can I say, uh, the, the recipe uh, is composed by main ingredients. Yes, I'm not sure I'm going to say that I have any, you know, promised solution or recipe for success. That's very complicated. What I think is worth acknowledging is exactly that. It's complex, it's changing. And what I really wanted to get across to our audience today was that Particularly if you're trying to do something uncertain, you're trying to pioneer, you're trying to do things that not many people have done before, then you need this combination of meticulous planning, choice of team. But once you're out there, now you need to let the plan go. You need to be flexible, creative, resourceful. And that relies on the skill set that each one brings to the project, plus your ability to be thoroughly adaptable while keeping your eye on the goal, all of which is complicated. But that's what makes it interesting, these yeah. things. Yeah, that's for sure. And do, do you think that the, the business community in this case kind of got the message? I couldn't tell you. I mean, I think I got uh, a great response from my audience, but we need to be realistic about these kinds of things. It's never one speech, one book, one meeting with your manager. Really good business people are learning all the time, whether they're coming to meetings like this, reading the books, working on their own self-development. And what we're hoping is to help build. If I put one more brick in a wall that helps someone build a foundation of how to approach uncertain circumstances, that's good. Thank you very much, Kerry O'Dowd.